to Roundabout. So the script of Roundabout was edited. So again, this is uh, the round of 32 changes. Um, and Roundabout's creator, whose name is Kyle, uh, submitted some changes here for what they think the next iteration of Roundabout should be. So, uh, just to give you some ideas, the changes that have happened, they made four changes in this round of 32. They removed the balloonist and added the general. They removed the amnesiac to add the, serv to add the savant, magician to philosopher, and lunatic to politician. So all good changes, as in not great changes, but good aligned changes. Uh, and Kyle also provided some notes, which I'll just read out to you for those who can't read or if you're on minimal resolution. Uh, lunatic proved to be a poor fit for this script, while Magician and Marionette were sufficient to make the Lunatic initially believe they were the demon. Without reasons for no night deaths or redirects, the demon had no flexibility in how to respond to the Lunatic's choices. I'll just insert myself right in there and just say that's a big issue with Lunatics on scripts, is that if you have no means of, like, substantiating why a Lunatic kills don't go through... It kind of ruins the facade of the lunatic, so I think that's a, I think that's a good change. Um, fixes like adding a monk mayor were considered, but were otherwise poor fits for the script. And in the end, I didn't believe the lunatic added enough to the script to warrant how much effort it would take for both the storyteller and the evil team to make it work. Don't force a square egg or a square peg, square egg, uh -huh. square peg through a round hole. Um, an additional point of tension was between the Vortox and characters whose information can't easily be reversed, like the Balloonist or the Amnesiac. The Balloonist's extra outsider felt necessary with Drunk Godfather, or felt unnecessary given that Drunk Godfather and Vigor Mortis are already on the script, and Savant ended up filling the Amnesiac's role better while also giving the Recluse some additional reach. That's true. Uh, I mean, the Recluse can obviously ping on an Amnesiac as well, it's just how the hell are you going to be able to tell? Uh, hey, it's, uh, Adam. Hey, Adam. Uh, I do agree. I do like pretty much all of these changes. And Haley. Hi, Haley. Um, Sean Burby, thank you for one year. One year. One year. That's amazing. One year. One year. Um, yeah, I actually do agree, Adam. I like pretty much all of these changes. Magician just doesn't really add a whole lot to this script. Um... I think, but I mean, listen. I think the general is an incredibly, uh, an incredibly underrated. Oh, it's that's your script. Good to know. Um, I think the the balloon or the general is a very underutilized, unappreciated townsfolk, and I think that it can add a lot to this script. So I'm perfectly fine with this. I think that's a great choice. Um, Philo is always a good option when you have this many info rolls. Um. I mean, I'm 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 on board with all these changes. I think these are all great changes. I agree. The politician one. I mean, some people have feelings about politician, but you know, whatever. You can't uh, tell the people all the time. <laughs> yeah, I mean, listen, it's a it's a it's a divisive character. You know, it has its uh, it has its flaws. It has its uh, you know, it has its uh, naysayers. But you know what? It's fine. I think that these are all really good changes. I think that the someone in uh, someone in our chat brought up earlier that marionette politician is kind of hysterical. I I like the idea of a marionette politician because it's just so convoluted. I love it. Um, but we're gonna see what the actual game looks like. So let's head over. To our actual game and we'll take a look now to see hey why isn't twitch chat or yeah why isn't twitch chat popping up over here nope that's not the button i was looking for twitch chat isn't hmm i am sad oh well I'll work on that during the day phase. Sorry you guys can't see your comments on the thing, but it's fine. Whatever. Um guys, what are what are we uh what are we hoping to see here? Because I, I have some things that I want to see personally. Um I would like to see How will we know what chat's saying? How dare you? You guys are just gonna have to read. 
Um, I kind of want to see a Legion game. I want to see what this script looks like with Legion. Yeah. Even Emma agrees. Um, I... So, I think that this script has a lot of good information roles that if we don't put a ton of them in, and you have a little bit, and then maybe like one or maybe like two info rolls, two action rolls against uh, against eight Legion or even a smaller amount than that, maybe do a nine three split. I think we can have some fun stuff, but I don't get to choose that, do I? No. No. Um, let's go and figure out what our characters are. Now, what I tend to do when we do World Cup is I do, I know a lot of people do the single shuffle. I like to triple click shuffle. I don't know why, but I feel like it gives a little bit of a better sense of rando. So we're going to do, let's see. We got Lil Monsta. Okay. So Lil Monsta means I now need to add an additional demon or sorry an additional minion um these are two very powerful minions already marionette little monster does not play a little well uh, real well though does it not i had a marionette as a little monster game once but that was because the marionette was in between the two minions so it was easy that way that's fair um, it's a bit of like a, a chicken and egg kind of thing too, as to like who gets to decide who becomes the marionette. Because you have to put the marionette next to one of the minions, but then you're deciding which one of those minions is going to have the baby the first night. Yeah. So that being said, I'm brainless. We're putting in a Serenovus instead. Fair enough. Yeah. Uh, now, we have outsider manipulation in the form of Godfather. So we could minus or plus one. I think I'm more inclined to do probably a plus one just because these are some really powerful info rolls for town. Okay. I mean, unless you'd object. No. Okay. Um... I think we just make someone a drunk. But let's take a look at the town suite for now so we can figure out who would be best for the drunken. Um, can't just give the baby to the marionette on night one and indicate they are marionette and not the other role. You could do that. Kind of takes away the point of the marionette. But it is something you can do. So... Let's take a look at this town suite. So we've got one starting info roll. We've got two bits of continuous night info, one day, three once per game. So we could probably manage to skip one of those once per games to give town a little bit more agency. Um, Are you thinking about is, removing it or just turning the one of the once per games into the drunk? I'm thinking about either turning one of the once per games into the drunk or actually genuinely adding another bit of night info. Um, drunk fisherman's always fun, Ed. Uh, it's definitely one of the better things you can do. I just realized also my AC is still on. Sorry, that'll be a lot easier for everybody to hear. Below isn't really once per game, yeah, I suppose. I suppose that's correct. Um... Drunk investigator that sees a poly and something else. Is Godfather going to be plus or minus one? I think it's got to be plus in this in this situation. Drunk investigator that sees a poly and philo. I've heard of worse ideas. Do I want to change any of these? I think Town Crier is going to be probably the most powerful role on this script. Or in this game, I should say. I don't want to drunk them. Godfather minus one sells a Vigo world. It does. But Lil Monsta is already kind of um, a handicap. Or it can be a handicap. And a politician so, may not come out early. A mutant probably won't. 
So to that end, I'm thinking that we probably maybe just, you know, let's just go with the classic. I think a drunk seamstress is fine. I think drunk seamstress is just fine. We're not doing anything crazy, but I think it's, I think it's fine. All right, so let's assign some roles. I think I'm actually okay with this. Yeah. We're going to need savant info. Now, chat, remember, we've got, what do you got, 45, 46 of you guys in here. Wow, did it just replace butt in butt spot with butt? Well done, butt spot. Um, all right, so we have, oh, look, we have Ryback, the drunk seamstress. Perfect. Uh, all right, so our evil team, we've got Dylan, Aiden, Malishan. I think it's perfectly fine. Rez as the politician is interesting. So for those of you who don't know, Rez historically is not particularly big on um, getting Mez turned. Um, so playing politician straight as a good player actually could be really interesting to watch. Unless Mal tries to get to her. True. Um, I really hope Bruce decides to Philo into Cannibal. I know that he will not, but I really think that would be hysterical. Oh, wait, we don't have bluffs. What am I doing? They don't need bluffs. No. These losers, they don't get bluffs. They're on their own. Uh, I, listen, if I was, Ta if I was, uh, Malishan, I would probably be hitting, I would probably be hitting the town crier. But that's, that's, that's up for, that's up for him to decide them to the side. Now, Widow gets bluffs. Well, Widow would see the bluffs. That's true. Widow would see the bluffs in a... in an online grim. I don't know if that actually is okay in the in a... I don't know if I like that in a in an on, in an in-person game, because I usually don't keep my bluffs on the... Oh, <laughs> damn it. Can someone ban Adam? No, don't ban Adam. Um, okay, so we don't have anything. Oh, so Karen as the investigator probably should see. Yeah, I guess politician's fine. Because seeing, seeing mutant as a, as an investigator is not great. Yes, I got it, guys. Thank you. Uh, skills, we were just talking about because it's Bruce, we think that he should philo into cannibal. We thought that would be the correct thing to do. What if the investigators saw Saranovus? I think investigators seeing Saranovus is probably best. Okay. Haley, don't tempt me. <laughs> also, there's a disturbing lack of Fowler next to uh, Haley's name. Can someone gift a sub to Haley? That'd be great. Normally, we would rely on Ryback, but obviously, they're in-game. Uh, I think giving... If we give the Saranovus as the investigator ping, I think we can probably... We'd have to give someone that is actually going to be, like... I think maybe Narn. Maybe Narn can be the wrong one. Because Fisherman's one of those roles... Oh, no, I killed Aiden. Oops. We're going to kill a Karen, too, just to make it look non-sussy. Alright. There's no demon tracking on this script, though, is there? There's Fortune Teller. It's fine. And it'll move around anyway, so I think the town crier is going to be stronger than a fortune teller. Haley's excuse is that they usually watch Twitch from the Xbox. Gotcha. Well, guess what? Now, Haley, now you have power. Oh, uh, now, now, Adam. That's not nice. It's not nice. That is an abuse of power. Because I'm pretty sure that's not Tyler. <laughs> I'm like 90% sure that's not Tyler. Uh, okay, so I'm feeling good about this. I think I'm fine with this, how this goes. Chat, you're going to have to help me out with some Savant info as we go through, but otherwise we should be fine. Um, you would never be logged into two accounts. Uh, okay, let's go back to town, and I have a little surprise for town, so that'll be fun.
Um, well, I have a little surprise for everybody, but I have a little surprise for town. All right, let's head back to town. Um, hello, yeah. everyone. Hello. Everybody good? Yeah. yeah. Hello. Hello. Can right. you guys see my camera? Your video is right. not coming up now. No. Uh, hang on. Yeah, I see a picture of Wendy. Yes. No, not working? Uh, why do you suck? Hang on. Uh, nothing's working today. It's okay. We don't need my video. You guys are just going to have to imagine it. Okay, so. Guys. Uh, before we get started today, wait, can you hear me? No, nope, because I suck. Hang on. Can you guys hear me now? No. What is happening? I think Discord's freaking out. Chatters, hang on one second. Uh, change the server on Discord. I might have to. Yes, I am aware. Thank you. Hey, there I am. That's what I. All right, hello. Hello, everybody. Hello. So we're not going to do the camera because apparently it's not working. I don't care. Whatever. It's fine. Um, however, you guys are just going to have to imagine it. All right. So uh, I have a little surprise for you guys, uh -oh. uh, which is just for some lovely content. So before we get started today, um, I'm going to do a little bit of a tribute to our good friend Patters over at Patters TTV, who I was going to thank for doing uh, the uh, bot that I was going to use, but it turns out it didn't end up working that way. Uh, but the we're going to make it work. It's fine. It's just not today. But anyway, so um, if you guys are old school fans of Patters TTV, um, you guys remember that one of my favorite things about Patters TTV was the, the old days when we would do... Um, when we would have other storytellers on there, including our good friend Stan, who would do my favorite part of Patters' TTV, which is crisp content, which was when Stan and his uh, iron stomach would bring in all different types of exotic flavors of potato chips and, the, and just try them and have them in various combinations as a way of being able to, uh, you know, see what is the most horrific thing possible and try them with different toppings. It was awesome. Stan's great. Um, because of that, Rez actually gave me an idea. And what we're going to do is we are going to do a little bit of my own American take on that, which is that I have actually purchased, and I'll hold it up here for the camera, the Brax tailgate candy corn that <laughs> Rez posted about earlier. So the thing my my wife is looking at me with like this horrible horrible look on their face. As they should um, as they should yeah. be. So uh the thing about these so they are candy corn but they have five different flavors and they're supposed to be uh right they're supposed to be flavors that are inspired by tailgating for um uh you know, football and all of that. So there's five different flavors, and it's like, okay, so these are things that I'm like, okay, whatever. In terms of flavors that are going to be things that are seen as things that might be palatable, I was like, okay, fine. So fruit punch, okay, sure, right? Fruit punch, sure, whatever. Uh, vanilla ice cream, mm, okay, you know, I'm sure it probably tastes fine, but, you know. Um, but then there's popcorn, sussy baka, but sure, you know, I don't know how that really relates to a, a tailgate, but sure. And then the remaining two are hot dog and hamburger. So for your viewing entertainment and your listening entertainment, we're going to be trying 
some of these candy corn today. And I'm just going to grab what I think these are, and we'll see which ones are which. I believe I'm going to start off with, I think this is supposed to be fruit punch and vanilla ice cream, I think. Let me just try one for good. Oh, God, no. <laughs> Starting off with a bang. I don't know what this is supposed to be. <laughs> oh, no. And then it just tastes... Died. Oh, God. I think this is supposed to be the vanilla ice cream, but it's somehow terrible. It's well, somehow it's like... terrible? Well, it's, it's like they ate that hot dog. candy corn. It, well, no, it's like they added the cone, too. So I was not expecting the cone. I was expecting just the ice cream. But there's definite other stuff in here. So is the hot dog and the hamburger going to have buns as well in it with the taste? Apparently, they also have, like, onion relish flavor oh, as well. Oh, God. Yeah. So I didn't... Listen, so when I went to go buy these, by the way, so I want to make sure I'm very clear on this. I went to... So these are exclusive to Walgreens stores. Um, and we have a Walgreens pharmacy next to us. So I went there. I went to go pick these up and I went to the counter and I put them on the counter and the guy behind the counter I've never met before just starts laughing. And I was like, what's up? And he, he was like, you're actually buying these, huh? And I was like, yeah, you know, uh, it'll be it'll be fine. Um, you know, and I said, yeah, it'll be fine. Right. And he's like, you know, I tried them before. I tried them like just today. And I was like, really? Oh, uh, were they bad? He was like, no, 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 they weren't bad. They were horrific. <laughs> and I was like, that's exactly the reaction I needed to hear. And then sure enough, I paid for them and I go to leave and he was like, have a nice day and may God have mercy on your soul. <laughs> so, wonderful. yeah. So I'm going to try what I think is fruit punch right now. I hope it's fruit punch. The fruit punch one should be fine. Ice cream one should have been fine. I've had a lot of fruit punch before. <laughs> this doesn't taste like fruit punch at all. But it's like the least objectionable thing that I can imagine fruit punch as being. You know, it, ta it tastes like fruit punch that's like been left in the sun. Oh. Oh, glorious. So would it be yeah. more like a, a fruit slap then? Kind of, yeah. Um... <laughs> Yeah, well, those are the first two that you guys get. We'll have some more starting on day one, and uh, I'm going to send you guys to bed. Oh, dear. Because then we're going to start trying combinations. It's going to be great. <laughs> Why do you do this? I'm glad that you're trying them, and I'm not. Uh, I'm, I'm, doing I'm, this, I'm doing this for you. Remember, I'm, I'm doing this for you. I'm you're doing this, so you don't have to. I'm very glad your taste buds are bearing the brunt of this and not mine. I'm, I know. <laughs> Oh, that was... Oh, God, that was terrible. Had I known that you were doing that, I would have bought some to try them also. <laughs> Do you guys have Walgreens there? Uh-huh. Oh, okay. All right. Let's send out some characters. Uh, and where we go here? And as far as whether or not this is good for World Cup's brand, uh, I'm just going to tell you, yes, it is. Anything is good for World Cup's brand, including this. Um... Surely the things with offensive tastes will be better when combined. <laughs> yes, I, you're probably right. Um, all right, let's uh, so let's do the let's do the fun stuff. Let's go to do we so with Will Monster. I mean, do we bother with doing the whole your minions are? or Do we just bring them all together? Um, I feel like it's usually easier just to eat them all into one cottage. Okay. I will send the characters again because Avery didn't get their character. It's fine. All right. Oh, God. Um, all right, let's go to Bruce first. And we'll see what Bruce wants to do. Hello, Bruce. Hi. Um, chat really wants you to use your ability to turn into the cannibal. <laughs> you know what? I was going to do that. Really? Yeah, I was going to use my ability to turn into the cannibal. Not because I think it would be helpful for town, but because I think it would be miserable for the real cannibal. 
Okay. So well, let's it's up that. to you, man. I you're just, actually gonna do it? Yeah, oh yeah. Give me the cannibal right. ability. <laughs> World Cup. World Cup, World baby. <laughs> All right. Get I will content. put that I will put that in. Tori, thank you for the five months. We love you, Tori. Thank you, Tori. Love you, Tori. Uh, that was the name of your Goldeen, right? Yeah. He died. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Or your Goldeen died. Yeah. All right. Still thank you very much. Thankfully. Yeah, I, I died like the first day, if I oh, remember correctly. Oh, immediately. Oh, my God. Yeah. I, was, I had plans for you, too. Oh, uh, well. It is what it is. All right. Thank you very much. Good night. Hello, Aiden. Hello. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, I am going to use you as the cabin to meet your fellow minions. Okay. Fair enough. Drag him in. Hold, hold, please. I'm holding, holding place. Hello and hello. Hello. With, without, without further indication... Just so everybody knows, it's Dylan, it's Aiden, it's Malishan. Um, without any indication of talking or any sort of communication besides pointing or naming names, please indicate who you think should be holding the baby. Malishan. Malishan. Who points to get myself? Uh, you're going to get overruled anyway. All right, Malishan's holding the baby. Good night. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Aiden, when do I come to you? Do I go to you yet, or do I have? You come to me a bit I have later. other stuff I got to do first. Yeah, it's a bit later. Okay, thank you very much. No worries. Oh, jeez, what did I do? There it is. Hello. How are you doing? Well, I've got sticky red fingers still, apparently. You know, it's funny, they were mentioning that in chat. They were like, why does Malishan keep getting the getting the sticky red fingers? I don't know. Killing my win rates, but that's all that's all good. I play for the fun, not for the win rates. Uh Jackie, would you be able to help out getting Monster back to a chair or to a cottage? Yes. Thank you. These are typical goosely duties. Alright, I just gotta locate him. Honk. Oh, wait. I hit the air horn instead of the honk. Okay, uh, so I'm going to be giving you a grim momentarily, good sir. Good person. Give me a chance to just send you a... You know, why am I doing it the confusing way? Let's just do it the smart way. We're going to do the snip snip. That because doing things the smart way is a goosely duty. It is. Kicked out of town and everything. Hey, 20... Come on. You know what it is? I think I cursed everything by getting these uh, these candy corn. Okay, good conclusion. I don't understand. This color is not listed on the thing, and I'm very scared. There's a there's a candy corn here that I have that is not listed as uh, one of the ones on the packaging. So I'm worried that it's like a secret uh, like sixth flavor that tastes like assholes or something. I don't know. Sounds like the first one already did, so... Uh, they all kind of... I'm sure they all will. Um, give me a second here. I don't want to blow up our DMs. I will send you your Grim over here. Upload. There's your Grim. Got it. Everything all good, Jackie? Yep. Thank you. You're the best. So, so while you're sitting with that, I'm going to figure out why Twitch chat is not appearing on stream.
So what are we thinking? I'm trying to decide between Karen and Avery. Because they are both likely to cause us problems down the road. I think I'll go with I'll go with Karen because I think Avery will just think she's been widow poisoned anyway. You said you're going to say go with Karen? Yes. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Now I got to go over here. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. So this changes things a little bit. So this changes things a little bit. Yeah. We don't have to show Karen... Uh, anyone. In fact, we could show maybe, say... You know what would be really spicy is if we show a marionette. Ooh. Yes. So, we could show Rez. Let's, like, spread it out. Let's do, like, Rez and... Ryback? Yeah. Well, so, all right, so the only problem with that, though, is that that's hitting two outsiders, and we actually want, the evil would want the outsiders to stay in play. We may actually be better off hitting, I mean, we probably should hit at least one townsfolk with it. So, I'm thinking maybe Bruce. Yeah. We put, I mean, Bruce as Philo. Philo is an easy, an easy bluff, you know? I think, I think I'm cool with that. I think we can do Rez and Bruce, and we probably should be, uh, Self and Rez? now now um molly we we bullied we bullied bruce into doing it um res and jason the problem with res and jason is if we're showing marionette that really narrows down where the demon could be i think if we put it next to then again karen will know that they're probably not the marionette unless they are the marionette actually that's fun no we're gonna show we're gonna do bruce we're gonna do bruce bruce and res yeah yeah I, I think that's the correct way. Um, Alright, so what's my night order? Where do I go next? I go to Dylan next. Okay, let's go to Dylan. Hello, Dylan. Uh, hi. I am here to inform you that you are aware of the fact that there is a drunk. Okay. And a mutant. Uh-huh. And a politician in play. Brilliant, thank you. I figured you would appreciate that. Thank you very much. Bye. Bye. And we're back. Hello. Who would you like to get the uh, the, the the bad juice? Um. Let's go for FM Jason. FM Jason. Yes, please. Let's make him the savant. Mad about being the savant. Awesome. Thank you very much. Indeed. Hello. Oh, hello. I have some news for you. Okay. The Saranovas has chosen you to be mad about being the savant. Ah, shit. I have to make up savant info. Okay. It's always the best one, right? You yeah. know, you hear that and you're just like, ah, oh, that sucks. All right, thank you. But hey, you're very welcome. Hello, Karen. Hello. Hello, Karen. Uh, I am here to tell you that uh, you know that either Resnora or Bruce is the marionette perfect thank you you're very welcome oh that's so spicy i love that yeah. that's just great uh all right so we'll do avery and then we'll do ryback and we're good for the night all right, all right. let's go to avery what's up i said all right i just agree okay hello avery hello uh 
Hey, Maida. Hey, Maida. Jack High. Jack High. Jack High. Jack High. Um, it kind of works. It works a bit. It kind of works. What do you think you're about to get? Um, I mean, I could get a two. That'd be fun. I could get a one and claim to be investigator, or I could get a zero. What would you like to hear? Two, because it's interesting. Okay. What do you think, Jackie? Should we just lie to her? Yeah. Okay. Um, I am going to give you the zero. All right. Thank you for telling me I'm drunk or poisoned somehow. You got it. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Uh, would you like to use your ability? Yeah, let's do it. Narninian and Jason, please. Narninian and Jason. You will choose Narninian and Jason, and you get a... No, they are not on the same team. Okay, thank you. You are very welcome. Let me just put your no ability. There you go. Thank you. Well, this is just going swimmingly. This is going fantastic. Yeah. I'm a big fan. How's chat doing with some savant ideas? Uh, you know, I haven't been checking, but because uh, I've been trying to figure out this whole uh, Twitch thing. Uh, who will be told that the widow's in play? That's a great question. We haven't done that yet. Um, some things that are false. Exactly one evil player is sitting next to an outsider. Okay. Um, X is a demon bluff. X is a demon bluff is spicy. But, heck, all right, so rules question. Do we have to actually come up with demon bluffs in little monster games? Despite the fact that we're not using them? See, I would think no, but... I would also think no. But I don't know for sure. I mean, I'm going to go with no. Ekin says no bluffs. Okay. I'm going to go with you are the marionette. There's cannibal in play. There is a cannibal in play is spicy. Um... Rez has to hear the Widow ping? So the, my only issue with that is that the entire point of the Widow's ability is that they get a chance. It probably should be, like, a genuinely good character. I do think it's okay if I give it to Monsta. Say Monsta or Narn? Give it to Monsta. Uh, let's go with that. Alright, let's actually head over to Monsta real quick. And we'll be good to go. Hello, monster. Can you hear me? What? Why are you visiting me? I am here to tell you that you hear the widow's call. Oh. Yeah. So I'm be that we don't have a legion, and that is good news. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. Or it's an atheist game, and I'm lying to you, but you know. <laughs> um telling you guys just so you know i mean we don't get them very often but if you guys really wanted to have some uh if the people who are doing world cup are watching give us some atheist scripts i would love to run an atheist game for world cup um 70 viewers you guys are fantastic um res will play for good i agree i think res is i think res will play for good um I wonder if Monsta will try to get Madness Kill to prove himself and the Widow's Call. It's possible, but there is a Saranovas on the script. So, um... Could be a self, self mesmerizing Saranovas or whatever it is that the Saranovas does. So I'm having trouble with my candy corn, just so you know. I'm only finding four flavors, and it looks like on the packaging there are two that are really close. Like, really close in their color distinctions, and that's just poor design. I mean, everything about this is poor design. They should never have been made in the first place. They're the spawn of hell. But I think that they could have done a much better job when it comes to distinguishing which ones are which. 
but oh well. We're just gonna have to gonna have to gamble and we're gonna have to see. Alright, let's bring him back and I will suffer. <laughs> I... Hello town. Uh you do find that there is two storytellers dead. Uh one of them. Are you only coming my my wife is only coming over here literally just for the candy corn to watch me suffer. <laughs> um so I'm having some trouble figuring out which ones are which. So there I believe the ones that are supposed to be hamburger and hot dog look almost exactly the same, which is horrifying. Um now what I'm going to do Yeah, please by all means try to help me out. Um I died from being impaled by a bunch of candy corn. Uh, Jackie just died just because they were actually murdered. So really, you're avenging Jackie, not me, but either way. I, I can't tell the difference. They look exactly the same. So I'm going to grab two of the ones that I think are hamburger and hot dog. And we're just going to have them at the same time. Because there's no way this can go bad. This is no. There's no way this can go terribly. All right. <laughs> Mm-mm. <laughs> <a> trash can. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's lovely. I oh. think this is... Pe oh. No. I think this is hamburger. I think they're both hamburger. Well, that's unfortunate, because now you have to find a hot dog one. I know. Oh, my God. These are... It, it's almost like, it's, I understand that they were going for hamburger, but I feel like it was a hamburger that was dropped on the ground. Oh, oh no. The White Castle. Because there's a distinct, there's a distinct dirt taste in here. Like, it tastes like the earth. Like, I just scooped up <sighs> some soil. That's the candy corn part of it. I was going to say, are you sure that's just not the candy corn flavor? I might. I, I mean. Oh my. Oh God. It does not go down well. I wonder if they tried to make it taste like, like it was oh. cooked on a charcoal grill. Cool. No, there's no char here. There's no char here. This is like this is like a a, a hamburger that was like prepared in a fucking microwave. Glorious. And then dropped on the ground. Lovely. Oh man. Oh well, that'll kill you. So yes, there's a reason I'm dead. Um, anyway, uh, ten minutes, guys. You have ten minutes. Oh, dear. Let's go. Bruce, you want to talk? Uh, yeah. Dylan, let's go. Uh, Ryback, you want to chat? Was that oh, Eden? Yeah. Uh, Ry oh. How are you, Karen? I'm good. You sound not happy to be talking to me. <laughs> What do you mean? I sound not happy. I'm trying to. Oh my god! Don't even make that uh, joke. I'm, Marco. I'm trying oh, okay. to be happy because I am happy. And I love talking to you. Oh okay. You want a one for one? Yeah. I'm the philosopher. You're the philosopher. Did yeah. You use your ability. I haven't used it yet. Okay. That's cool. Mm. Do you have any idea of what you might want to use it with? Uh, whatever you're not is definitely on my radar. <laughs> Whatever I'm not. How, how, ge how generous of you. Mm -hmm. um, I am the philosopher. <laughs> yeah. Really? Oh, yeah. Uh, okay. Now is an um, important have... time to tell me if I'm your new man. Have you, have you used it yet? I have not. I'm waiting to okay. find out what you are so that way I don't use that. Me. Yeah, of course. Just like I'm you the were waiting. Me. Well, I'm the philosopher. Yes. I well, can. there's there's multiple sources of madness on the script, so I'm I'm gonna yes. put you down as some form of mad for now. I'm gonna but put you're, you you're, down. You're definitely claiming philosopher. Yes, and you're definitely claiming. I am Godfather? definitely claiming philosopher. No, okay. not Godfather. No, no. <laughs> I'm just wondering. I'm just wondering. Hello. Hello. I was hoping to get my advice. 
Uh, let me confer with Jackie really quick, and we'll be right back. Well, I wasn't expecting this. Yeah, no, me either. He's like, I want some advice, and I was like, let me ping someone. Um, what is some advice that would genuinely help Narn in this game? Um, I know I wasn't expecting it. Um, <laughs> don't eat the ha candy corn. It's a good one. Um, Um, what if... What is Good's best route to victory? Good's best route to victory, I think, is the Town Crier. So I would say the advice probably should be find the real Town Crier. Hint about demon type? I think that is a hint about demon type. That's too on point. Don't travel northwest. Um. Hmm. Keep Bruce alive for he needs the experience. Yeah. Um, find advice. Don't worry about Legion. Yeah. Protect Bruce is actually not bad. Um, Malachan just claimed cannibal to res too. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. Um, pairs are good or bad, depending on context. Um, find your favorite role. Uh, trust only one of your neighbors. Thing is, I don't know about that. I, I you know, I'm going to go with... <laughs> Tomato's not the only one inter eating interesting things. Your key to winning is lying about their role today. I like that. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's do that. Hello. Uh, myself and the Substagoose have, uh, have convened, and we came up with... You should be aware... That your key to winning is lying about their role today. Okay. Okay. So my key to winning is lying about their role today. Okay. That's helpful. Thank you. You're very welcome. Um, do you, uh, I'm not your marionette, am I? Uh, nope. Not at all. Goodness gracious, no. Okay, cool. And you are not mine. Do you, I, I, would you be open for a one for one? Um, sure. I'm oracle. the investigator. Ooh, You're the oracle. I'm the oracle, indeed. Okay. Um, I haven't told anyone else my info, but my info is Bruce and Bresnora marionette. Oh, glorious. Mm, yeah, I'm not too sure about it but um do you, have you have you told anyone else that you're the oracle no let's see real quick uh okay um yeah i uh i will tell you that I, i'll tell you that i'm the same one. 
Um, it's a okay. good. I've been waiting actually for Demeta or Jackie to jump into one of my chats so I can get my information because I didn't want to ping them and just out me as the, as the savant going for information. Okay. So I'll go ahead and scooch for you then, if that's the case. That would be awesome. All right, see ya. Hello. Hello. I am bluffing savant or fisherman is what I'm telling people. Those are two things that are not what you actually are. That's pretty good. <laughs> so I'm just coming from my savant or fisherman info. Uh, I've told, I don't really trust Avery's claim actually of not trusting me and as Nora. Um, but they're the only person that I've actually told that I have seen the widow. So we'll see how that works out. Okay. But thank you. All right. You're very welcome. I would like to go after one of my neighbors today because I Oh, uh, so a I get drunk and... info tomorrow. You want me to get drunk info no matter what? <laughs> no, but like, I don't know what Narninian is. I think Narninian's a good person to go after. Yeah, I'll nominate Narninian. Yeah, let me do that. Like yeah. I said, I got a two. So I'm happy to, I'm happy to get rid of both of my Both neighbors. of your sussy neighbors? Especially, I mean, I'm ha actually, like, you know, I'm more keen to go after Avery, but, like, honestly, I'll go after either. I'd be more keen to go after Narninian because Avery wouldn't use Empath on you. Avery is likely would be a minion in that case, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, That's Narninian could just be the demon. Narninian could be the demon. I could, I could say that I'm the fortune teller who did a ping. Is there a fortune teller on the script? There is. I think I was debating on using it as a using my ability for a good role or for a cannibal, and I decided on cannibal. All right. Well. <laughs> so, oh. Is it okay if I jump in here? Yes. If you'd like to. I wasn't sure if you all were having things or if this was the setup so I could come do my consult. Um, I think it. I think it ended up being that. Okay, cool. Well, um, I'd love my savant info today, please. All right, so I will tell you. There are exactly two once per game roles in play. Okay. Or the demon is exactly two seats away from their nearest minion. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, oh. cool. If you were the seamstress, have you used it yet? Uh, if I am the seamstress, I have in fact used it. Okay. Um, have you heard and... word of a cannibal floating around? Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back. So, fun story. We're still dead. Wow. Well, <laughs> That is fun. I'm going to give you guys about 90 seconds, and then we will do... Uh, we'll do nominations. Real quick, Narn. Do you have to nominate yourself for your plan to work, or can I nominate you? You can nominate me. It's fine. All right, cool. Bruce. Oh, Rosnara. <laughs> oh, what a game. <laughs> <laughs> what a game Nora is shaping up to be. Are, Nora, are you sticking to your to your thing? Absolutely. 100%. Very cool. I'm, I'm, gonna be, I'm sticking to my thing if anybody is interested. I'm going to be advocating for my death today. I have either a start knowing role or like I'm a spent seamstress or so, something along those lines. Um, so... I think I'd be good cannibal food if there is one, and yep. I am also going to be advocating for my death, and honestly, I think I am really great cannibal food. 
Rapunzel, so what? she's probably in a good place there. I Wait, have heard of two cannibals. Oh no. One of them, one of them, one of them's a philo cannibal, so it's fine. On the script, and so are Novus, so lots of reasons. I do not believe the cannibals are in a pixie pair. Well, with that, nominations are open. Avery nominates Narninian. Avery nominates Narninian. Why? For I insist I die, Narninian insists they die, one of us must die. Narninian, shall it be you or I? <laughs> I appreciate the rhyme. I, I already mentioned, I, I haven't, I specifically haven't claimed my role to anybody. Um, so this would be a pretty good cannibal test. Um, yep, that's it. I can confirm that Narn has not even claimed his role to me. So there you go. Um, we would need six for this to pass. Six is enough, Narns on the block. Future, any other nominations? Uh, Monster nominates Avery. Monster nominates Avery. Tell me why. Um, witch check. Oh yeah, by the way, everybody, there is a witch in play. That's a witch. A witch? There is a witch in play. How do you know there's a witch in play? Because I was told that there was a witch in play. I think you mean are you widow. Are you saying widow? widow? I mean widow, yeah. I was going to say. <laughs> and I was I, told I, that I, there's I a vortex in play. You guys, we all know what I mean. I saw a widow, so watch out. They're, like, they have the grin, so it doesn't matter really what's going on. I fight that notion. For if we all give up and throw our hands into the air and say, oh, well, the evil team knows our role, so we shouldn't do anything or make any plays, there are only three players, the evil team. Uh, they cannot mess with all of our info. The Widow can only mess with one person. Uh, there is no other piece of information besides the Serenovus um, that can cause uh, information to appear wrong on the evil side, and the old demon can only kill one person a night. So to throw our hands up and say, oh, there's a widow in play, let's not care about our rules, is, in my opinion, not a good strategy. Okay. Well, we would need six to tie or seven to pass. Wait, was that your defense on why you shouldn't die? I mean, I'm cool to die. Kill me. Like, I don't care. That's why that was my defense. Yes. I actually want to die, but I'm going to respect Nerninian. Three is not enough. Any other nominations? We're gonna end the day in. I'm sorry. I just I told Avery I gave her a sympathy vote. Oh, okay. Any other nominations? I will take your pity, and I will love it. Gonna end the day in five, four, three, two, one. Narn, what is your preferred method of execution? No? Oh, I'm, I, I'd like push to talk. Sorry, I'd like to go on the coolest water slide ever, and um, it just happens to be a canyon at the end of it. Well, this particular water slide is actually the pride and joy of Ravenswood Bluff. It's the reason why people come here in the first place. Um, unfortunately, Ravenswood Bluff was hit with a massive drought a couple years ago, and what once was a river is now just a canyon. Um, it's been condemned for years, but uh, in honor of Narn, they reattached the hoses because we don't want you flaying your flesh on the way down a shitty dry water slide so you get the water slide part it's great but then you go yeet and you go into the former river now canyon 
and you have a lovely old time banging around on the rocks. Like a beverage, like a drink on the rocks. Narn is executed and dies. And speaking of dying, let's try two of whatever this fucking flavor is. Oh. Oh no. Oh no, I found the fruit punch. Oh, that means the other one wasn't fruit punch. What was the other one then? I don't know. The uh, punch. Punch. <laughs> oh, this is actually decent. Oh, I gotta find more of these. These are like the palate cleanser. This is good. Okay. I found one that is not hideous. Sure. I want to know what the hell so this... the flavor was that you thought was fruit punch at first, because none of those should be anything like fruit punch. No, they shouldn't be. This is genuinely like fruit punch. This tastes like... Yeah, this tastes like... Um, like Hawaiian It's like punch. a... Ho yeah, like a Hawaiian punch. Like, if you can imagine a Hawaiian punch as like a, a gummy, that's oh. basically what it tastes like. Oh, These are genuinely delicious. decent. These are genuinely decent. Um, all right, we we dodged the bullet, guys. Uh, everybody go to sleep. Well, I bet you the one you thought was vanilla ice cream might have been the popcorn one. I think you might be right. I think I feel like I would tell popcorn though, so maybe it was like actually like hot dog and it just tasted terrible. I don't know. It, it, I can tell you, it whatever it is, it's bad. It's bad. Uh, all right. Uh, no outsider died, so we don't have to worry about that. Let's go to Aiden. Oh, by the way, did a minion nominate? No, they did not. Uh, minion not nominate. All right, let's go to Aiden. Or do we do Little Monster stuff first? Little Monster is always so hard because it's not on the fucking thing. See, I usually do the little monster at the point that it has it in the night order. Don't know if that's right or not, but... It's before all of them, so I'm going to go with... It actually would be little monster for... No, little monster goes after... Weirdly, after Saranovas, but before Godfather. Weird. All right, let's go to Saranovas first. Let's go to Aiden. Hello! Uh, same as yesterday, please. FM Jason as a survivor. You've got it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Guess what? What? Sarah Novus has chosen you to be mad about being the savant. Okay, I'll make up more info. Thank you. You're very welcome. All right, I'm bringing I'm bringing the party in. Go for it. Hello. 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 Please Hello. indicate who's holding the baby. Aiden? Narninian? Yeah, I'm fine with Aiden. Okay, then. Did you say Narninian? Yeah. yeah. What? <laughs> okay. I heard two... I heard two Aidens, so we're going to go with Aiden. There was two Aidens. Yeah. All right, Aiden's holding the baby. Thank you. All right, so funnily enough, we're going to go to a Dakota cabin before we go see Avery. So there's not actually a whole lot that happens at night right now. Um, with all these once per days used, we actually don't have a whole lot of night actions. Um... So Avery's still going to get a zero. Nothing changes. Bruce is going to have the ability. Town is going to get a no. There's really not much that happens at night. But we have to pretend that stuff happens at night. Good chance to talk about stuff about it, though. Yeah, so uh, last yesterday I gave... Um, yesterday I gave some basically two bits of info that seemed to suggest that it's not Legion. That said... I could probably give some Savant info that sent, tends to push towards Legion today. You're surrounded by bad meals. 
Karen is a Karen's an okay meal though. Yeah. Karen's a good meal. Um Fish advice today would probably be Execute both your neighbors would be very strong advice. Stronger than people are generally comfortable with. Um, what if it was something along the lines of, like, there aren't that ma there there aren't that many good restaurants near you, but there's at least one. For the fisherman advice? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I was thinking, uh, Deck, what is your huge favor? I was thinking Widow Poison player counted as poison. No, they do not. It's, it's going to have something to do with Bruce, I'm sure. Yeah, that's a good point, Molly. I don't know flavor-wise how that makes sense. Um, stop by Ryback's college, Cottage and tell him he's a putz? Easy. Let's do that right yeah, now. Right now. Hello. Hello. I've got some news for you. What am I mad as? Um, you are mad because of the fact that Dak has requested that I come here to tell you that you're a putz. Oh, duck fact. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, I'm going to go with, for Savant Info... We had six noms on Narn yesterday. Six votes? I could... S six votes, yeah. Six votes on Narns yesterday. What if... What if it was something along the lines of, like, exactly five Legion members voted on Nar uh, Narn yesterday? I know this pushes basically that the other bit of info will be correct. Yeah, actually, no, I can't do that because we've already heard a widow's call. Someone, yeah, it's not going to work. Um, because they're also eventually going to get a two kill knight, and there's literally no other way that there could be a two kill knight unless there's a godfather. Um, I thought Legion could have multi kills. That's a good point. But the, once the once the Sarah Nova thing happens, or yeah, yeah, if that um, breaks or something, yeah. Yeah, that basically ruins it. So, basically, the only two people who know it's not Legion right now are Jason and Monster. Karen thinks it's not Legion, but it's not guaranteed. Um, the Recluse has misregistered at least, or, or, or misregistered once last night. No, one night death is um, it, one exactly one night death is low monster. Legion can be any could be anywhere between one and whatever the maximum number of legion is. Each legion can get a kill. Speaking of, who's dying tonight? We could save ourselves a lot of trouble and kill day, but we're not going to do that. I feel like we could probably kill Ryback, right? Yeah. I mean, it sucks for the Godfather. Who votes is not nearly as important as who noms. That definitely does suggest that it is... Yeah, I don't think I can sell Legion anymore. The Demon voted on multiple nominations on day one. Town believes there's a Widow in play. Monsta has claimed it. They don't know that, though. Avery got info tonight? And when do Little Monsta kills happen, though? Little Monsta kills are supposed to happen at the time of Little Monsta's ability, correct? I believe so. But have we gone to Avery yet? No. No. Eight 
Avery dying probably is not the worst. We haven't gone to Avery yet. We can kill Avery judiciously. Because we have not gone and got given information yet. Because look, if we go Night Order... Oh, hang on. If we go Night Order, the things that can kill Avery before Avery goes are literally the only things in the game. If Avery dies after getting their info, they would know that it's a weird thing. So we can't give Avery info and kill Avery, so we would have to kill Avery now. Which I'm okay with, by the way. I feel like killing her now will point away from Little Monster for a little bit. Yeah. I'm okay with that. Um... The only other thing we would need to do is figure out Savant info. I can work on that. Just kill Karen? That's too easy, though. I feel like we could share Karen for the next night. Yeah, killing Karen shows that it's a little monster. I'd like, or a Legion. I'd like Bruce to try to maybe eat Karen. Yeah. But I don't think the used role should always die. I agree. Let's go. Let's, yeah. So let's give Jason their info. Hello. Hello. Still alive. I thought it was uh, I, I am here to give you the fact that yesterday, no minions nominated. No, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with Avery dying. I think that's fine. Avery is... I don't think either one of Resnor or Monster are probably going to die anytime soon, so I don't really think they're going to get a ton of information. And even if Monster does die, I mean... You know, I, I don't really, I just, I don't see the, I don't see a ton of upside there. And I think it definitely will make it, you like your Savant Info skills? Okay, well, let, let's, let's take a look at your, your granddaddy Savant Info and see a how good it is. A poisoned a one-time use ability or an evil targeted another evil last night. Or an evil targeted another evil last night. Neither one of those are true. A once per game. It's not a once per game. I'll go with your I'll go with your bad info. I'll go with an evil targeted an evil. Then again, evil targeting an evil. Who would who would target an evil? It'd have to that's selling Vigo. You're trying to sell a Vigo world, basically. I think I can't sell a Legion world. We'd have to sell a Vigo world or a Vortox world to move away from Little Monster. Um, how about the drunk got sober information? Or the, dr the drunk got correct information? As the fake as the fake bit of info. Because that can actually point to it potentially being a Vortox world. Yes. And the good bit of info would be... I don't want to do a Droizend player. I want to do specifically the, the drunk. drunk. Because then it pushes the world that maybe the Vortox is in play. Mm. 
I don't think I like the wording of, of skills as suggestion. No offense, skills. Um... At least one of your neighbors... No, that doesn't help. What if it's just as simple as there's a politician? Eh, the, the politician's probably going to come up as a politician. Um, what if it's something as simple as uh, there is a fisherman in play? Narn hasn't come out as fisherman. Yeah, let's do that. I'm, you know, we're the night's going long. I it, when it, when Navian's here, Navian normally it just pushes me along. It's like, okay, we're gonna just do it this way. Okay. And <laughs> yeah, so we're just gonna go. We're just gonna fuck it. We're do it live. No, I don't care about the unreds. Take me to Moverbot. Hello, everybody. All right, so two things. One, Avery's dead. That's the thing that most people care about. Two. This is a flavor I haven't tried yet. I'm just going to pop two of them in and see what happens. Good luck. That's what she said? Yeah, I was about to make hey a yo. that's my job joke. Okay, guys. I'm very confused. Uh-oh. Because the flavor that I haven't tried, that I just tried now, is 100% the vanilla ice cream. Which means that the two shitty flavors I had earlier, that I thought were fruit punch and vanilla ice cream... Somehow, we're s want two of the oh, set of popcorn. What the, the vanilla ice cream one was the popcorn because yeah, you said it had like the cone. So that was you. probably popcorn. Okay, I could see that. All right. So here, so here's my dilemma, guys. I've taken more than half this bag, and I've divvied it up. And like I said, two of the two of the ones on the cover look exactly the same. I only have four different piles here, which is almost worse than what it actually should be, because that means that somewhere in here, one of these flavors actually has two different flavors in them, and one of them could be good and one of them might not be. So like Fruit Punch, which is my go-to, may actually be maybe Fruit Punch, but it may also be like the whammy. So I'm terrified right now. I don't know what to expect. And this is, uh... wow. All right, this is going to be hard. Uh, for that reason, I'm going to just, I'm going to move things along and I am going to try whatever this one is and hope it doesn't kill me. This may be hot dog, given the fact that it has like a yellow and red color scheme. Maybe that's what it's supposed to be. Let's try. Oh my God. <laughs> is it hot dog? Wow. That good? That is putrid. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That is you poor so. Oh my god. That 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 is truly wretched. That is it tastes like there is absolutely mustard in here. Mustard should not be in here. It it almost tastes like mustard. It, it's mustard flavored vomit is what it tastes like. Oh, dude. oh, my, oh god. my god, that is horrific. Um. Wow. All right. Well, that was a thing that happened. Uh. Anyway. Uh. No, it definitely yellow mustard. It was distinctly yellow mustard. Um, you guys have, let's say, eight minutes. You guys can reconvene at 36. Karen? Yeah, let's go. Zameda, can I steal you? Yep. Boosh, you want to lie to me? Uh, what can oh, I do you for? Uh, I realized I wanted a clarification on yesterday when you said there are exactly two once-per-game rolls. Um, those okay. are not including uh, you start knowing, right? Once-per-game would be the ones that specifically say once-per-game? Yeah. Awesome. Uh, I'd love my day two information, please. All right. So your day two information is either there is a fisherman in play 
Okay. Or the drunk received true information on the first night. Or sorry, on the second night. The second night would be the night that just finished. Yeah. Yes. Perfect. So I have there is a fisherman in play, or the drunk received true information on the second night. Thank you. Correct. Yep. My info is correct because I trust you and Nanian. And Dylan didn't give me demon vibes, though it could be it could be little monster. Maybe you're the marionette. I don't think I'm the marionette. Because Bruce definitely didn't sound like a. Hi. I would like to Hello. use my ability. Question mark. You would like to what? Use my ability question mark. Oh, because you're the cannibal. Of course. <laughs> oh, gotcha. Um. I am going to give you All right, I'm going to give you some advice. Okay. Your advice is There are not a lot of good restaurants around where you live. But you should look for the one good one. Hold on, I'm just trying to type all of this down. Uh, there are not a lot of good restaurants around where you live, but you should look for the one good one. Yes. So that implies Legion or Vortex. Okay. It implies something. It implies something. Thank you. Yep, you're welcome. I didn't tell you about it. Hello. 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 So, to fill you in, uh, I am the cannibal. I'm asking my fisherman question, which is drunk by the philosopher. So it's getting a bit complicated to figure out what I'm going to say. <laughs> that sounds like a pickle. Yeah. Um... Oh. I'm sure Jackie will be able I to like, help you out. I like this. I'm... Oh, yeah. I I'm going to go with something like be cautious of your neighbors, they might be mad about something. Which is... Okay. One, I'm going to go with one of your neighbors, because that's true on one side. Okay. okay. Uh, something like that. I think... Uh, Alright, sounds good. Something like that. I might try to tweak it, but that's the general idea. Thanks a lot. Alright, bye-bye. No. Okay. Because I can imagine them doing Philo at bat. Um, okay. Alright. I, I kind of think we need to figure out what exactly Narninian was, because that will tell you what your number ought to be. Yep. Alright, yep. thank you. Cool. Thank you. Prior now. Okay. Uh, day is the actual savant. Okay. Uh, right back is a drunk. I didn't hear what role he was, but he, I, was, I just noted down drunk. I think it's empath. Uh, empath, cool. Uh, Bruce is kind of, is the philo turned cannibal. Okay. Uh, Karen is the investigator. Are you the pixie? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay, I am now realizing that it could be a Vortox. That yeah, that's what, what that's what Ryback and I were just discussing. So it is, um, so in that case, if I'm getting a zero, it means one or both of my new, uh, my living neighbors are evil. So my thought process was you could be evil, but you... The conversation we had, if I'm going to pull a mouse on this, going to bite me in the ass. The conversation you had, you had to have thought on your feet pretty quickly to uh, make that. Because I but I did not say empath, I said seamstress. That's right. Yeah. I really fucking hope you're the pixie. Otherwise, I died for no reason. Um, and you're just evil and you're going to win this game. But um, I am willing to trust Jason and Monster right now. I would like to go in the other direction. So, I... What do you think of Karen? Karen... True info on night two. 
Okay. Yep. okay. So that's what I've got to work with. I'm not going on a Vortox game yet. Um, no, I, I, I've been hearing information that might suggest a Vortox game. I'm also mildly concerned. The same information could still mean a Legion game. Maybe. I really want to know what Nardinian is. Uh, depending on what that is, it might push me towards probably a Vortox game. But we'll see. Yeah, I mean, my info, my first day of information I see being, actually, um, uh, I'll have to ask Domata in private because that would probably, oh, hypothetically, Domata, if you hypothetically gave us Avant information in a Legion game relating to minions and demons, uh, would you just arbitrarily register any one minion, any one Legion as a minion? They, they are, they are minions and demons they are all they register as minions well. and demons not up to the storyteller that's right okay um yes so yeah the so the information of the demon is exactly two seats away from the nearest minion would be hard to happen in a legion game yep if that's um, a true one yep and then if the other neighbors which i trust so i think that my info is drunk okay um okay that makes sense um i've also heard that it's probably not a vortox well, i've heard multiple pieces of info suggesting not vortox um yeah my i'm trying to see if my info um my info doesn't look like vortox info but i guess it could be it's a little too hard for me to tell for two days but um it doesn't scream vortox or not vortox i'll say that does your um, info suggest that there might be a Serenovus in play? Uh, my info has not given any indication that way. Um, okay. Uh, but yeah. Interesting. So, maybe... Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back, everybody. We'll give you about 60 seconds, and then we'll do nominations. Monster, I think it would be still good to check on the other theory that I was talking about in uh, private chat, if that's okay. Yeah, I just wanted to put that into your ear to make sure that you kept that, like, kind of still in your thoughts. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll think about it a little bit tonight. Well, this town's very talkative. Let's uh, open up nominations. Ryback will nominate Jason. Ryback nominates Jason. Tell me why. Um, I've heard of a ping on Jason. I'm not going to reveal what type of ping it is. Okay. Jason? Um, I'm a good player, uh, but I don't know what the ping that you're talking about is. We would need five for this to pass. Ryback, I don't think I trust you. That's fine. Can we talk tomorrow? Sure. I'm happy to get this on the block. If we... Hound has someone else that they really feel is a better kill, we can... Um, Br Ryback, if it's information coming from you, I... It might be a reason to mistrust it. There is way too many um, pings and things of distrust that I've heard so far. No, I mean, any, uh, any other nominations? Do we think it might be a Vortex game? If, if it a... could be. If it if it if anyone thinks it's a Vortex game, I want Monster dead. Monster nominates Monster. Monster nominates Monster. Why? Um. Avery wants me dead. Can I defend Do you have the defense monster? by chance? No, that's fine. Okay, wait, can I, can I defend you? Sure. It's not that I want monster dead. It's that if it is a Vortox game, my information points that monster is probably the evil of the two people that would be evil in that case however the as i say this i feel like i've had like i'm having deja vu where i said the exact same thing and it was the other person who was evil so maybe we shouldn't kill monster even if it is a vortex 
I, I have heard of information that points if it is a Vortox game. I'm I'm willing to die, but if it is a Vortox game, there's also information out there that's pointing me to actually being good. We would need five to tie or six to pass. I don't think it's a Vortex, and I think that Jason is not a good execution. Don't want so that raises his hands? Know. Are people Are thinking you? I'm evil? Like, what is... Oh, oh, to get him off the block, I see. Yeah, to get Jason <laughs> off the block, because I agree. Monster got six votes. Jason's on the off the block. Monster's on the block. I'm gonna just end the day in about five minutes because I don't see that getting pat or five seconds. I don't see that getting pat uh lifted. So made a quick quick storyteller um question about rules yeah. clarification. Uh, do you run fisherman advice as reversed or not reversed by a Vortox? Uh I rule it the way that it has been officially ruled, which is that it is affected by Vortox. Okay. That is an official that is an official thing. Malashan nominates Ryback. Malashan nominates Ryback. Why? Uh, don't feel strongly about this, but we're getting towards the end of the day. Uh, I'm not sure Monster's a good kill. Um, I do think Monster might be an outsider and don't particularly want to track outsiders. I think they'd rather go for potential evils. Um, and somebody said that Ryback's information might be suspect, which just made me think maybe someone had a ping on Ryback or something. Uh, if it's another reason, no reason to kill Ryback. Right back. Um, a couple things. One, need six to tie. I don't really want to do this if we have a Vortox. Um, I also have reason to believe that down the line that a person who is dead and Jason are not on the same team. Okay. Um, we would need six to tie or seven to pass. Oh, that makes sense. I think this might be better. Right back, you might be an outsider as well. Three's not enough. Gonna end the day in five, four, three, two, one. Monster, what's your preferred method of execution? Straight up cannot hear you. Like Park Simpson going down Springfield Gorge. <laughs> what is what is with you guys today? Jesus. Um Yeah, sure. Uh it's violent. Monster is executed and dies. And congratulations. I'm gonna down three of whatever the fuck this flavor is. Oh no. Oh, God. <laughs> You're gonna regret it. Oh, that was a bad one. That's me with Monaco's. What is this flavor? I want three. I think this is popcorn, and my god, it's horrible. I think this is the first one that I had, and yeah, it's terrible. This is definitely popcorn. It's very buttery. It's like really buttery. So when you thought it was uh was ice cream, it was buttery ice cream? Yeah, it was really buttery ice cream. Okay, bye. <laughs> Alright, well... Well, we do get a Godfather kill tonight. Yep. I'm very excited about that. Um, however, Bruce, Bruce needs to <laughs> start. Needs to just not claim outsider. Oh man. All right. Uh, first things first. Let's go to Aiden. Hello. Hello. What are we doing tonight? FM Jason is the font, please. You got it. Thank you very much. You already know the deal. Mad about being the savant. Okay, thank you. You are very welcome. Hey, buddy. Hello. Please choose a player. Who? Mm. I... I switched over to a town crier claim, so I'm tempted to kill Jason. But I think Aiden's keeping them Sarah locked, so let's hit Day instead. You gonna hit Day? Yes, please. Okay, thank you very much. 
And I'm going to use your room as the staging area, so... Okay. Yeah. Who's holding the baby? Uh, I'll point to myself. Dylan. What was that, Aiden? Dylan. Yeah, I said Dylan as well. Oh, okay. Dylan's got the baby. Thank you very much. Okie dokie. Alright, so, who do we kill? Great. We really can't kill... We really can't kill Bruce. We could kill Karen, but that goes against Bruce's info. Then again, I can't control that in a normal game. Um, shit. Do we kill Malishan tonight for balance? No, that's probably next week. That's probably next tomorrow night. Next night, yeah. politician killing politician might not be the worst or Karen yeah those are kind of my two candidates they really need Jason yeah they need Jason <laughs> wait did I leave voting history on god damn it I did <laughs> Oops. But most importantly Jason's gonna learn that a minion nominated yesterday which is huge Uh, I think Ryback, since killing Godfather, since Godfather likely won't kill Ryback. That's a good point, actually. Yeah, we, I mean, I... Hmm. Yeah, Savant's already dead, so... Kill Dylan, one Godfather kill is good already. Mm, no. Um, I'm actually okay with Ryback. I think Ryback might actually be the best choice. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so we do that, and all we have to do now is go visit Jason. And no more Savant info, yay! <laughs> Still alive! Okay. Um, I am going to give you that, yes, a minion nominated yesterday. Thank you, thank you. You're very welcome. And I don't think we have anything else to do tonight, right? Yeah. We just have to monitor Bruce to make sure that Bruce isn't mad about being a uh, an outsider. An outsider. Now Bruce can say I'm the cannibal that has the mutant's ability because saying he's the cannibal is claiming a townsfolk, right? Yeah. Okay. I mean, I would rule that as claiming to be a townsfolk. You're not claiming to have. You're not claiming to be the mutant. You're claiming to have the mutant's ability. I would argue that there are some people who would probably say, no, that's still bad. But I'm going to give them the, uh... yeah, we're going to find out. Anyway, all right, let's head over to sending them back. All right. Hey, town. Um, I am here to tell you that we have... Two players dead. And those two players are Day and Ryback. And I am going to, in honor of this double kill, I'm going to double kill myself by putting two of the two flavors that I know are wretched each. So we're going to do a quattro of death and we'll see what happens. Why do you hate yourself? <laughs> wow. Oh my. While the beta is murdering themselves, uh, I think the double kill proves that it's not a Vortex. Go on. How so? I am an empath, starting empath. I got a zero. Um, I'm not saying Resnor is good, or I believe Resnor is good, but for Masta to be an outsider and it be a Vortex, I could, I guess I could have got a zero. But I, I just trust Resnora. 
No, no, no. Can we chat real quick? Actually, let's go. All right, we're good. Go ahead. I'm, I'm still alive. Where's Where Nolan? Uh, return at yeah. 54. Um, awesome. Are you, are you the... I, I, I was the spot, if you haven't figured that already. And one of my days of, fisher of information included there is a fisherman in play. So. Okay, so it's not Vortox. Okay. Um, the Pixie Empath. Okay. Because I think Avery was a bigger killed minion. Fair. And I That's want... A fair thing to say. I want to see where like she's that. going with this. Yeah. No, that's reasonable. So wait, if so, you're going Pixie Empath, then you got the Empath ability. That's the story that you're telling Avery? Yeah. Okay. Curious. Um, my information, though, does suggest that I might be the Widow Poison person. Because I got that too, which is us because both of my neighbors are dead and the only mm. way i could see them both being evil is if um narninian was the widow who was like well i'm no because then they wouldn't be widow poisoned anymore yeah no fuck it nope can't see any reason why that would work i have to be widow poison for yeah. this to make yeah. any sense or the drunk or the drunk um, yeah, maybe or the drunk but like so i like I mean, or, or it's a Vortox game, right? That's the, those are like the three things. But yeah. like Ninian, and I got a yes. Uh, night three, so day two of nominating, uh, the people that nominated were FM, Jason, Ryback, and Malishan, and I got a no. So, unless, unless Narninian is a marionette somehow or monsters a self-poisoned widow then from my perspective i'm either poisoned or vortoxed yeah fair help me out here um right. one it's great that we went back to true town form when there's a cannibal in play and killed an outsider wonderful work um but i do have fisherman information from yesterday that I can run past you to hear what you say. Okay, I thought Day was the fisherman, but okay. Night one, I think they poisoned someone night one that was gonna only get info that night or something. Sorry, my daughter is right here. And they just didn't care about that. Like that, and when I went to go talk to them, I said, I said, oh, so you're, you're a first night roll, huh? So you don't mind dying. I was like, or are you the widow that I saw? He's like, no. So. What, what first night roll did Narn suggest that they had? Well. They they just said, they suggested that they had a you start knowing roll. Well, I've heard of a pixie potentially elsewhere, so we're either talking investigator or chef. So, okay. All right, well. That suggests there's a Godfather killer, simulated Godfather kill, or the STs are fucking around with this. So, all right, that's all I got for you. All right, Thank cool. You. Does all your right. Savon information suggest it could be a little monster? Um, my Savon information is definitely not uh, uh, precluded, little monster. Um, I think that my Savant information is basically pointed to it not being a Legion game because one of my pieces of like I've had two pieces of information. I got a sober chef would receive a zero, uh, and then the next night I, I got there are no outsiders sitting next to evil players. Um, which, yes, if, a... unless those are both wrong, uh, that pretty much precludes a Legion game. Um, they could just be the two wrong pieces of information I've gotten, obviously, but um, it leads me to believe it's not a Legion game. Uh, unless there's no outsiders, well, but like the, the world where there's not any outsiders sitting next to evil players in the Legion game is small, so yeah. Um, um okay, yeah, all right, thank you. Um, I will say, uh, my fisherman advice if it feeds into yours is information from the four cardinal points, not including my own, is not to be trusted. Gotcha. Okay. So there is information pointing to you being evil from Ryback, I believe. So, and then I didn't tell him that I was um, 
I didn't tell him Pixie, I didn't tell him Town Crier, I gave him, like, Fortune Teller, uh, Chef, and, um, Seamstress. However, at some point, if I do come into contact with Jason, I think, maybe at this point, I might have to go more in direct conflict with Hold him, on. suggesting that he's a minion. If if I go, if I go the pixie route, and still maintain that it's a vortex, I could learn an out of play role technically, but that means that I'd never get the ability. Um, I maybe sorry, maybe is, that's is, the is, role is, that is, I uh, go with. Sorry, sorry to interrupt you. I've just told Karen our code to say that I've actually still got a zero. Okay. So ignore what she said. I'm still going zeros. Okay. Gotcha. That's possible, yeah. So oh, I'm, I'm like, I'm playing along with her thinking that I'm the pixie because it, like, I want her to think that like I'm her, what, what that she's marinating me, right? Like that's the that's the phrase Kale used, right? Yep. Um, yep. Shouts to. But like I don't, obviously Kai. I don't trust. Her. Shouts to Kai. So I'm just trying to like. She's pointing me in one direction. I'm thinking of going in the other direction. And if I'm, if I am, if I'm the poison from a vigor kill, then I want to look hard at Jason because after Avery died, I got zeros both nights. And you know, like, if I'm getting incorrect information and one of my neighbors, one of my living neighbors is evil, well, I went, got a read on Jason the monster and Jason and you. Yep. And the, Jason's the one consistent there. And Avery seems pretty like, no, we shouldn't kill Jason. Okay, I mean, I'm okay with that. I, I was thinking Bruce was a good thing to at least see what Bruce had to say today, but if you prefer Jason, I'm okay with that. I. I I mean, unless yeah, the widow is lying. Is. I, I, I have. Him. What is, What is the info for the Serenovus? Thirty Just seconds. Quite and clearly being made mad. I know who's Serenovus mad, and they're good. Yep, yeah, but not. We really need to talk tomorrow, please. Okay. And with that, nominations are open. Uh, Bruce Do nominates think... Aiden. Bruce nominates Aiden. Why? Why not? Aiden? Groovy. I rather than stay alive, though. Okay. We would need four for this to pass. I think this Do... is a good nom. Do we think it is a Vortex game? No. I so either I will just tell you that my information tells me that either an Arninian is lying or it is not a Vortox game. Aiden is on the block with four votes. Aiden nominates Jason. Aiden nominates Jason. Why? I heard there was a ping on him. I still haven't heard where that ping comes from. I'd rather not die, really. I'm in a workshop with someone. Um, but that's all I'm going to say, and I feel my info could be potentially good uh, going forward. <laughs> what do you think about that, Jason? Uh, I'm still just a good player. I've been good the entire game. Okay. We would need four to tie or five to pass. I'll say this. I'm the fisherman. My entire ability is basically boiled down to you should trust Jason. Wait, 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 wait. I don't no, if this wow. don't this. Please, no, please don't tie this. Please don't tie this. Shit, sorry. I don't know if it's a little uh, monster. Four is enough to tie. There's uh, one on the block. Karen nominates Malishan. Karen nominates Malishan. Why? I believe that Malishan is the widow or some evil. Okay. Malishan. First I've heard of it, and not. Um, Bruce knows what I am, there's no one knows what I am. Not sure why this would be a good kill today. We would need five for this to pass. Anybody want to save my Yeah, can, can we get a living vote on this? Malshan, I know what you are, but if... I just... 
I'm not sure which one of you and Bruce to trust at this point. Five is enough. Now Sean's on the block. I don't know why that has to be mutually exclusive. It also doesn't. I could trust... Bro if I trust both of you, then this isn't actually a terrible execution. Jason, real quick. You're not. You're still not claiming Pixie, right? I am the Savant. I have been the Savant the entire game. The Pixie game. has already been... Already got their ability. I'm going to end the day in 10 seconds. Also, Malachan. why did I die as the empath on night one in a little monster game? Malashan nominates Dylan. Malashan nominates Dylan. Why? Uh, I'm... I've not a good kill today. I think I can keep getting information. I've got very little information about Dylan, so I'll just giving the town the option to move it. Okay. Dylan? We're at five on Malachan. I don't think it's wise to try and lift it off of Malachan, considering how many alive players that we have. It's kind of a waste to use up dead votes today. Okay. We would need five for this to pass. Two is not enough. I'm gonna end the day in five, four, three, two, one. Malshan, execution method, please. Was it Badgers? Mm -hmm. Yes, Always. Badgers. Uh, European or American this time? European. Oof. Okay, we're gonna go with the classic. Um, it is a blur of black and white, and you are red all over because of it. Malishan is executed and dies. And congratulations. I am about to try popcorn with fruit punch. Ooh. Everybody go to sleep. Yay! <laughs> oh, how does that make it worse? Did you think it was going to make it better? <laughs> well, it would make it better. I mean, it did not make it better. Adding butter to. Oh. It's literally like if someone took your lemonade and just poured butter in it. Melted butter. Oh. <laughs> or butter in your fruit punch. Oh, it's terrible. Um. Alright, so Bruce is gonna get fake info today. What was Malachan bluffing? Cannibal. <coughs> That's really funny. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, I just need a minute to cough this out. Ooh, okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Uh, all right, Aiden lives. Let's see what happens. Let's go to Aiden. Right. Wow, who shit. gets it? What are you thinking? I thinking I should have let me take the fall for the evil team. Um, but yeah, it is what it is. Yeah, the, the best case scenario it was Malachan, and I, I think he said he used it on Karen. So, no harm, no foul, I guess. It's just an annoyance we've lost an evil team member. Uh, it makes our lives a bit more difficult, I guess. Um, I'm in two minds whether to keep FM Jason as mad as a savant uh, if Town had figured out that he's mad. Um, or do I make myself mad? I'm not entirely sure I should go with this, to be perfectly honest with you. Uh, but you need a decision, which is the annoying thing. I know. It's the worst. How dare you. <laughs> I know. <laughs> um, I... I'm going to go with FM Jason, but I'm going to make him mad as a pixie. Okay. Thank you very much. All right. Sarah Novus has chosen you to be mad about being the pixie. Okay, that's at least better. All right, thank you very much. I'm actually going to go to Malachan now. I just want to see what Malachan's saying. What was your question? So, in the world where I'm not bluffing and I actually am the cannibal, 
<laughs> what happens when a Philo cannibal eats a cannibal? It's a good question. <laughs> um, theoretically, the Philo cannibal. You, you, so you're not you're you would be. We were actually just thinking. I was just thinking about the same thing. Um, you as the cannibal have the ability. I guess the cannibal would have the the Philo cannibal would have the cannibal ability. Yeah, I guess it would just be no ability. It wouldn't track yeah. back to the previous day or anything. It would just be you have to cannibal doors. Okay. Yeah, that's what I figured. But... All right. It's a bit of an uh, it's a bit of an inception thing going on there. Yeah, and at that point, I mean, infinite loops are generally handled with parties become drunk. Yep. I mean, that's kind of basically what's happening anyway, so, yeah. <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you. Hello. Hello, give me my yes. Oh, no, I just wanted to make sure that I was telling you the right thing. I told you Pixie yes. instead of Savant, correct? Yes, you told me Pixie. Okay, awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So who's going to die? Oh. Well, first of all, we got to figure out who the baby's going to. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's do that first. Hold, please. Evil team, please indicate who should be holding the baby. I'll point to Dylan. I will also point to Dylan. Too. You're also pointing to Dylan. I'll point to Dylan. Your You're, you're going to point to Resnora. Okay. Uh, Dylan, you're holding a baby. Cool. Their their best bet is literally giving it to Resnora. I'm just saying. Yeah. But I think I think there's that just slight hesitation. <laughs> Right. Um, if they... Alright, so... I kind of want to kill Jason. I know that really kind of screws over Aiden. But the madness is still in effect, even if they're dead. Yes. And it really doesn't matter if they're dead, because pretty much given the number of players who nominated yesterday, they Jason probably has to know that they're getting a yes. Mez with the double... Res with the double waffle out when they have the baby? It's actually very possible. Um... Okay. I'm thinking... We give it... Did he kill Bruce? I don't think Rez would out today the way she's been playing the game. Maybe kill Karen? My choices are basically right now between... I don't think kill Reznora yet. Um, no, I want to keep that open. <laughs> Jason basically has a yes on Malachan specifically. Yeah, let's give Jason one more night of info. Let's kill let's kill Karen. Bruce. What else is Bruce gonna possibly gain? We'll just kill Bruce. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So let's go to Jason. Yes, a minion nominated. Thank you. You're very welcome. Okay. Uh. Yeah, I think we just killed Bruce. All right, let's head back. All right. Hello, town. Uh. There was a vicious, heinous murder in the night, and that murder was that of Bruce. However, yes. slightly more heinous is the fact that I'm going to try one of each of the four identifiable flavors together right now.
somehow the hot dog beats out everything else. Oh my god. That is truly... I don't know how the fruit punch makes it worse. <laughs> that might be... That might genuinely be one of the worst tasting things I've ever tasted in my life. Have you tried all of them together yet? That's what I'm eating right now. Uh, yeah. Oh, and there's butter. Oh, I just got the butter. Oh. There was a chance it could have been good. I mean, not How long they got? Not a big chance. This is like... This is like... Pig level Nar, can we talk? Yeah, let's go, Avery. Let's give you guys... Uh, let's give you guys... Four minutes. Karen, can I talk with you? Uh, you can join. I just want to talk to Reznor real quick, but you can join if you want. I don't mind. Okay. I've yeah, got okay. important info. I specifically right. wanted to give it to Avery as well, but I'll find her late. I mean, you're dead. Why can't you give me your roll for free? Because I was vigor killed in the night, and I want to know what to tell my deal. Ah, good call. Yeah, 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 um, yeah. But no, I, I'm actually, I'm planning, I'm keeping my Savant info close to my chat, close ah. to the chat for now. Savant and like so Savant and so Ah, so you beautiful. Canadians are so cute. I'm the philosopher. Oh shit! Okay, that's okay. Give me a minute. That okay. could theoretically change everything. I philosophized into the savant. Which night? Uh, night one. God damn it! Okay, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. Don't worry oh. about it. Are you the philosopher, though? I am the philosopher. Okay, that makes sense. I've heard of an investigator. Yes. Um, so, yeah, we were roll shopping. I'm, I'm not entirely sure what said investigator wanted to achieve out of it. I just went along with it and just kind of hoped for the best, really. Um, maybe to yeah. try and stop evil yeah. killing into me, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, I will tell you, uh, I am the pixie who has the savant, savant ability. Um, I I wasn't Ooh. sure yesterday until uh, towards the very end of the day uh, whether I was actually the savant or not because I had two hard claims uh, of savant, uh, and then uh, one of them had died, but I wasn't sure if the other one had uh, the other one was still alive, and then the other one died last night. So now right. I uh, I assume I have actually got it. So um, after you leave here, I am gonna. Talk to Danita. Okay. Cool. That's a thing. Yes. So, uh. Yeah, I'll, I'll let you know to talk to people you need to talk to then. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. Hi, Danita. Hello. I've had to make up four days of freaking savant information. I could, because I can't really claim anything other than Pixie Savant at this point. So, so whoever that Sarah Novus is, I'm messing with you pretty good. They are, and the actually changing it to Pixie, I was like, that's good. And then I was like, wait, no, that's really bad. Because I like actively told people I was not the Pixie yesterday, which is why I came up with two people claimed Pix Savant to me, and I was making sure they were both dead before I hard claimed. I don't know. I just want to die. Okay. Um, but that's probably long enough. All right. Thank, Thank you. you. Uh, I'll step aside. Oh, actually, Tomato, you're here. Yeah. If Bruce can uh, walk away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So for my day one information of there are exactly two once per game roles in play, um, if if there were two once per game roles in play and a drunk who thought they were the third, that would not satisfy that or that would satisfy that? Well, the drunk isn't a once per game ability. Okay, so it's not three, two, two, to not two tokens were handed out to people who have once per game abilities. There are two once per game roles. God damn drunk. Okay, thank you. Nope, no problem. And I haven't gotten a town crier ability, so I don't know what's going on. That is the problem we know. Yeah, um madness. Let's be aware of madness, I guess. Ooh, yep. Yep. Yeah, um, I'm curious to know if Jason's still claiming someone today. Dylan, what I will say is if you are not mad, right? Right. And you are the pixie. Resnora is evil. Uh, full stop. End of sentence. Resnora is evil. So. 
So that is where we're at. I'm willing to give you the benefit of the doubt, but it, it, you, you and Reznor are uh, diametrically opposed. Right. I thought your, I thought your empath information pointed to both me and wants to being good. Unless it was a Vortox game, which everyone is saying it's not. But you're the pixie, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I think so Dylan's just evil, or being made mad. Like I don't Dylan's either mad or evil because Reznor, you're the pixie that got the empath ability. Also, <laughs> Reznor, what was your empath number? Last night I got a one. Cool. I Aiden's evil. Don't trust Aiden as far as I can throw them. Yeah, Aiden's evil for sure. Uh, town said. Hello. Everybody, I'll give you 30 seconds and then we're doing the thing. Jason, are you still the savant? Um, I was the pixie, uh, and now I have the savant ability. I had two people claiming savant to me, so I was waiting until they were both dead before I outed as the actual pixie. <laughs> That's the what? <laughs> what is this? What? What is this? Oh. <sighs> No, 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 Reznora. Dylan's evil, Jason is Sarah Mad. Or one the other way around. Basically, one of them is evil, one of them is Sarah Mad. I trust you. Jason, are you what? willing to say who the other Savant claim was? Uh, yeah, I will tell you that it was someone who died last night, which was, uh, Bruce. Okay. Bruce, you're claiming um, Savant. Nominations yes. are open. Bruce. No, I'm not the Savant. <laughs> The Are you kidding me? Maybe no. it, it might have just been a day one claim, but I had them both on my grid. Yes, I have never been the savant. Not once. I think oh. Jason might be the politician. Mm. And we don't have a Serenovis. Narn's evil, so my information lines up. What? I'm not evil. Hang on. Sorry. Actually, yeah, maybe Jason's just... There is no doubt in my mind that Narninian is the widow, and they're trying to get into the good circles that they can get information, and that they can keep getting the information that they that they need to rely or relay to their evil team. But they're wanting to kill people who other people are pointing to as evil as well. So, like, and all I'm gonna say, I think Aiden's my least trusted person right now, and then Karen was my second choice, just because of what I said to a few people today of. I heard nothing pointing at me, and then they suddenly jumped on me, and it just felt really strange. And then everybody voted on that, even though several people who knew my claim and apparently trusted my claim still jumped on it, and that was just weird to me. Well, the second call yeah. for nomination. Karen Listen. nominates Aiden. Karen nominates Aiden. Why? Uh, we lifted Aiden off the block yesterday. There's multiple sources of info saying that Aiden is evil. I am willing to kill Aiden. Aiden? Cool. Uh, I can understand this, sadly. Uh, I was, I am your oracle. Uh, last night I got a two, for some reason. I'm not entirely sure what's going on. Um, but I have been getting zeros up until that point. I rolled something with Karen. Um, imagine me, quite a funky code. Happy if there's, if it was a zero, and unhappy if it was uh, anything other than a zero. I quite enjoyed that. Anyway, I was saying oracle investigator. But um, yeah, totally understand rush now behind this. If there's info saying I'm evil, then sure, I'm not entirely sure if we can trust ourselves to be if it's if it to be evil. But I I understand why you guys are wanting to do this. Three would be required. Karen, what was the second name in your information? Uh, I got Reznor and Bruce. Bruce, is it possible it's Bruce? And Bruce maybe didn't know. Wait, what? <laughs> Three is enough. If it, if if Dylan's the demon, Bruce is the marionette, yeah, and then monster, one of Jason or Aiden is the other minion. What? Well, I guess it could be Little Monster, and Dylan was holding the monster. Yeah. Oh well, it just has to be next to a minion. It doesn't have to be holding the token, yeah. actually. Yeah. So if 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 it if it's Dylan, Aiden, and then literally anyone else. Bruce could be, or if it's Dylan and Aiden specifically, right? It could be Dylan, Bruce, and Aiden. With Jason, you guys, I'm just gonna. As the I'm gonna speed up the game a little bit since we are a couple minutes behind. 
Um, I'm going to end the day in 10 seconds if there's no further nominations. I don't think that there's room for a marionette with this setup here, because like we've said before, we have proof of a widow, proof of a Sarah Novus, and apparently proof of a godfather as well, because the two kills on the one day, right? Who is the proof of the Sarah Novus? Five. I am. Four. I'd be made mad as the Oracle. Can someone nominate Dylan, please? Three. Two. Jason nominates Dylan. Jason just gets in there in time. Tell me why. Uh, I'll pass it off to Avery if they want. Is there any other proof of a Saranovis besides Aiden? Because if there isn't, I don't think there's a Saranovis in play. I think there's a Godfather. I think there is um, a, a marionette. And I, uh, what was the other thing? The other, the other one, the widow. I think that is the play. I think it's Dylan, Bruce, and Aiden. I don't think Bruce was told. Um, I don't know if Bruce even could be told how the little monster works. I do think Jason could be the politician still, which works with our outsider count because we are missing an outsider. I think this works. Dylan? I am not evil here. I am the pixie. I saw Town Crier starting off the game. I've been claiming Town Crier and suggesting that it's a Vortox because I just haven't been able to find another player that is claiming Town Crier. Uh, so right now, my guess is that the person that is claiming or the person that is the town crier has been unable to claim it because they've been Sarah Madness locked this entire game. I understand that that puts me in conflict with your uh, information, Avery, because that would make Resnora the evil person in that conflict between the two of us. But at the same time, I am good. I'm a pixie. I saw a town crier. If we have a town crier still in play, please let me know so that I can be confirmed here. Okay. We will need three to tie or four to pass. Not any, and you're really potentially using a dead boat on this? No. I would. I'm just, I mean, if I was going to vote, if. It was going to be a tie or something. Yeah, I, I would have a thousand percent used my dead foe if there was three other living hands. A thousand percent. Zero's not enough. Going to end the day in five, four, three, two, one. Aiden, execution type. Muted. Muted. By listening to Nickelback. That's just cool. It's a cruel death. That's, that's. I talked about my candy being a Hague level offense. That that's a war crime. Thank God that um, there, thank God that there are Canadians in here. Uh, there are Ooh. a couple Canadians in chat. Um, <laughs> Nickelback's awesome. I'm sorry. Ah. It's a Aiden complete. is executed and dies. <laughs> and congratulations to both teams for getting to hear me wash down the hamburger one with the popcorn one. Oh. Mm. Grim. Nope. Didn't make it better. Oh, oh, oh. I very I didn't make it better. Oh no. Go to sleep. <laughs> Alright. I'm telling you, they gotta give it to Rez. They I, I'm real worried if they give it to Rez, she's just gonna be like, I'm holding the baby, kill me. And I don't think it's going to get her killed. I genuinely don't. Okay. Well, let's see what they're going to all do. Yep. Hold, please. They call it the party cabin for a reason. Dylan. Uh, please indicate who should be holding the demon. Dylan. That's Nava. <laughs> ah. Uh. Hmm. I'm going to go with... Uh, this is actually really hard. I think... Do you know what? Go out with a bang. I don't care if it's throwing. I'm going with Resnora. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah.
This is so good. This is so good. Oh, this is exactly what I wanted. This is exactly <laughs> what I wanted. Yeah, Aiden didn't right. sound too thrilled about that, but I feel like it is the best play, though. All right, so do we kill Jason? No, we, we probably kill Karen, right? Yeah. We kill Karen. I mean, killing Dylan would be the spiciest thing. But just in case Rez gets on the block, you kind of want to give Dylan the, the opportunity to nominate, I think. Agreed, yeah. Unless so, Rez puts herself on the block. <laughs> yeah. Um, we got to go tell Rez she's holding the baby. I know. I'm just trying to think <laughs> who we kill. We technically have to kill first. Okay. If you kill Dylan, they go for Rez. Yeah, we got to kill Karen. I agree. All right, let's go to Res. All right. Hey, buddy. What? You are holding the little monster. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. No, I am not. <laughs> you are holding the little monster. How? How? I'm here to tell you that you're holding the little monster. That's all. All right, thank Thanks. you very much. Um, did a minion nominate yesterday? Yes, right? Uh, no. No. No, a minion did not nominate. Oh, wait, did Mal? No, Malishan didn't nominate. Nobody nominated yesterday. It was just Karen and Jason. Yeah. So a minion did not nominate yesterday. Ooh. Ooh, I got a little shiver up my spine. All right, let's go to Jason. Yeah, all right. Still alive. Oh wow. But not mad. Thank God. Thank you. However, I will tell you, a minion did not nominate yesterday. Yeah, I didn't think so. Thank you. Yep. This is exactly. This is exactly what I wanted to happen this game. I mean, we. I mean, we are technically running the kills, so I guess we are responsible for it. But that's not the point. This is exactly how I wanted this to go. Us choosing kills is different from player agency. <laughs> exactly. Uh, all right, let's send them back. All right. Hello, town. Um, I can tell you that Karen is dead, and so is my dignity, because here come two ham or sorry, two hot dogs, one fruit punch. Nominations are going to be open all day. We do a round robin. I love one. I could facilitate. Oh God. <laughs> or I could. Can you? Please, please, please do, Jackie. All right, starting at the top with Ryback. Themestress, night Rock. one. Jason and Nardinian return to no. Dylan. Pixie, I saw a town crier. I still have yet to get my ability. Bruce. As a philosopher on night one, I turned into the cannibal. Um, night two, uh, after Narninian died, I got nothing in the night, and then I talked to the storytellers, and I got the advice of, there are not a lot of good restaurants around where you live, but you should look for the one good one. And then we executed an outsider, and then I died. Karen. I was the investigator. I saw Resnora or Bruce as the marionette. Aiden. Oracle. Uh, zeros up until the night before I died, and then I got a two. Malishan. The real cannibal. Uh, after Nan died, yep, nothing happened in the night. I asked for fishing advice and got, you can trust your neighbors, but beware of madness. Um, could be pointing at various things, but I've got a music plane next to me. Uh, obviously nothing happened after the outside next to me was died, and then I was also killed by the town. Monster. I was the mutant who saw Narninian the Widow. Avery. Empath Zero. Rez. Pixie, 
the empath. Uh, I got my ability after Avery died in the night. Um, my information is going in chat. All right. Fisherman, I got the advice. Uh, don't trust information coming from the four cardinal points, excluding yourself. Jason. Town Crier, who has been mad the entire game until literally right now, putting my info in chat. There you are. Oh my gosh. Dang. Really? Oh, wow. That's huge. Um, I am the savant. Um, I am putting my info in chat. And that is your round robin. So I think there's a living politician. Um, um, can I can I have the floor for two seconds? So since I have not uh, been able to actually say any real info this entire game. Uh, so based on my info, um, I think Malishan was absolutely definitely one of the minions. Um, I think Malishan nominated the next day to cover for one of the minions beforehand, which was definitely not Karen. So it was either Bruce or Aiden. Um, and then if Dylan is claiming a pixie town crier, that could absolutely be correct. Cause I'm the actual town crier, which would make the last evil resonant. Would it also work if Resnora was the demon and Nernanine was the marionette? So, uh, Nar if Narninian, my, mm. Narninian being the marionette would mean that my second day of Fisherman info... Actually, so then that would mean... No, because my day one info does not match with um, Narninian as the marionette because the demon... Sorry, hang on. Actually, maybe that would... I'd have to look through the info again. Nameda, can you please mm -hmm. clarify whether um, a little monster can kill two at night? A little monster can only kill once per night. Okay. Can you please clarify um, when you would give a pixie their uh, their ability? Uh, when the player that would they are mad about is dead. Um, um, uh, okay, the question is, if a, a player dies at night before they go, their ability is scheduled to go, would you give the uh, pixie that ability that night? So you're saying the thing that causes the death happens before that player or that ability that they're gaining would go? Yes. Then yes. Okay, thank you. Narnanian, did you give your uh, info in town? Um, I posted it, but basically, I do not trust the information coming from the four cardinal points, excluding yourself. So, um, that'd be right back Karen's and Monsta's info. Now, Monsta is, doesn't have info, but at the time they were alive. So, like, whatever they're bluffing as would be incorrect information, presumably, potentially. Uh, Karen has investigator information that is probably wrong, and Ryback has seamstress information that I believe to be wrong. So that would clear Jason. Um, and I'm assuming then the thing that you told me before was just a complete and total falsehood? Um... Oh, oh, the the other thing, I, I, yeah, I, I was spreading around different pieces of advice, but that is the advice I got. I'm okay. make this the second call for nominations. I think that we should nominate Resnora. All my info seems to be pointing to that. Unless, I mean, I guess. When, when did the Oracle? When did the Oracle finally get a two? Uh, was it got a two as of uh, the night before I died? Before I was nominated. So, did night night three basically is when you died. Okay. I'm just. I'm wondering if you were if you are the drunk and you received true information the second night as. Yeah, I, I'm just wondering if you may, maybe got true information the second night. I I am. But I'm, if you didn't I'm get confused, a two, to be perfectly honest, you didn't get a two. Yeah, if you didn't get a two until later on, then it doesn't make sense. Um, I, I, yeah. I think that there is no Oracle in this game. Oh, yeah, I think Aiden is evil. N noms are open, correct? Yes. Correct. Okay. Dylan will go ahead and nominate Resnora. Dylan nominates Resnora. Tell me why. So I've been giving this a whole lot of thought today. Uh... I'm not the pixie. I'm not the town crier. I'm not anything that I said before. I'm the politician, and I have been deciding on 
whether or not I wanted to try and slip in with evil, thinking that I might have made enough noise, and I just don't think that it's been enough for me to win with evil. So I I think uh, unless Jason has fooled me with all of the Saranova stuff uh, and is actually the demon faking the Saranovas, I think Resnor is probably a pick. Res? I mean, I think we do likely have a politician alive. I don't think it's Dylan. Um, I think it's Jason. I think... Dylan is evil. I think it, all of the multiple different claims have been super sus. Um, I've been the pixie empath the entire game. Uh, the real empath is my neighbor. They got a zero on me. I just, I feel like I'm really being set up by evil here and, and the politician and there's not really anything I can do, so. Okay. We would need two for this to pass. We need five votes. We need here. a lot of hands here. Yeah. Yep. This is. Yeah. I'm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh Dylan. God. Dylan dropped. Can Dylan. Another please vote. You can just win with us. You can just win. With... Oh my gosh. Four is enough. Resnor is on the block. Um. Any other nominations? If anyone's the politician, but, I just right, Rez, ask not to. I know. In. Rez, you're the politician. I, I I mean, you probably get the win here with evil, but like if you don't nom, you can just win with good. Final call for nomination. And end the day in literally nobody's saying anything. If anyone wants me to make a nomination, I'll make, make a, a nomination. nomination Nova. Nominate Dylan. Good. Resnor nominates Dylan. Oh, come on, Res. <laughs> Resnor nominates Dylan. Why? I'm not entirely sure what the fuck is happening, but I'm pretty sure Dylan is evil and a demon. So, yeah. Dylan, your defense? Love wins. Oh, come on, monster. This is just a feels bad, I think. And... We would need four for this to pass. Or sorry, four to tie, Ma five to pass. I implore you, I'm not the widow. Please don't vote for this. Like, another politician win is going to be so gross. Two. Yeah, this is Seriously, it's people bad. are listening to Narnini, and this is ridiculous. This is why I don't like politicians. Uh, anyway. Five. five is enough. Dylan's on the block. There are one, two, three, four, five, six votes left. Jason, would you like to nominate yourself? Uh, no, because it's irrelevant. Do it. Okay. <laughs> no, I just game want the game to end. is going to end because Dylan is dead. And congratulations to the good team for killing all three minions and to the evil team for winning. Right back. Winning vote. Congratulations to the evil team. So, let's start off with Ryback, your drunk seamstress, who picked Jason and Narn and was told no. Dylan, your godfather, who was aware of the fact that there was a drunk in play as well as a mutant and a politician. Bruce, your philo cannibal who gained the ability of Narn, your fisherman, then gained the ability of... I don't remember. A mutant. The mutant, right, of course. That was not helpful because, as we know, Cannibal is an outsider. Of course. And then, uh, then gained the ability, interestingly enough, of a Serenovus who was claiming to be the cannibal. So the question was, what happens if a philo cannibal eats the cannibal? Yeah, that's fun. Uh, Karen, your investigator who was widow poisoned on night one and saw that there was a marionette between Bruce and Resnora. There was no marionette in the game. Aiden, your Saranovis, who was Sarah locking FM Jason for most of the game. In fact, pretty much the entire game. Malishan, your widow who chose to poison Karen. Monsta, your mutant who got the widow's ping, the widow call. Avery, the empath, who got a zero on night one, 
and then was killed by the little monster kill because that was the kill that made the most sense. We did not want to indicate, given what the savant info that was going around was, that it was a little monster game from the get-go, so we took a swing and we decided to kill a relatively high-value target with a uh, little monster kill to hide the fact that it was a little monster game, since in the very beginning of the game we were in flux as to what particular type of uh, game it was. Rez was your politician. The politician who was playing both sides to begin with, because the uh, info that Rez was sharing was definitely not saying, I'm the politician. And then after pretty much Aiden was dead, Malishan was dead, and Dylan was the only minion left alive, uh, Aiden was like, no, let's just give the monster to Dylan. It was the right idea. And Malishan was like, no, give it to Rez. And Dylan sat there for a long time, and contemplated, and eventually said, you know what, let's just give it to Rez. So when I woke Rez, the Mother good politician, and said, you're holding the demon. Alishon, you are sleeping in the guest room tonight. <laughs> you should have punished, uh, quite... should have punished him, them by uh, not letting them win. Yeah, you could have won with him. Two of us. <laughs> fuck no. Fuck no. <laughs> I couldn't let this opportunity slip through my fingers. Like, yeah. how often does a politician get handed the baby before Final 3? And, and just so you know, Rez, you did indeed switch alignments and win with the evil team, just in case you were in doubt about that. Thank you. Uh, Narn, of course, was your fisherman, whose fisherman info was, or fisherman advice was not what they were claiming it to be, but I'm pretty sure Narn did it the... Uh, because the fisherman info that they had was actually not super helpful. Or at least that's what I suspect. Um, the fisherman advice I gave to Narn basically was to, uh, more or less find and protect your town crier. Uh, because I said, I believe the actual advice was, you're, the player who is your key to victory is lying about their role today. And that kind of led them to the idea of it being... Uh, Jason being the player that they really need in, or in order to win, because Jason was your town crier, who got true and sober info every night, but was Sarah locked by Aiden the entire game. And Day, of course, was your savant, who got two days worth of info that we were trying to use as a means of deflecting as to what demon type it currently was. The Legion game was basically debunked almost immediately by a bunch of people, so we tried not to feed into that. But, yeah. So, and, um, yeah, that was your game of Roundabout. And yes, Narn, your, your, your fish advice was actually more helpful than ours, but, you know. But day one fisherman advice is kind of... Wait, I'm not complaining. I'm not Narn complaining. I just decided Narn. to read the room and get good info out there. Hmm. Narn's actual fisherman info basically was to find J find out who was lying about their role and realize they were the key to victory, which was FM Jason being town crier who was Sarah locked. However, that was not what Narn said the ability was. Yeah. They won in our, in our traditional first whisper when I spoke to Vez. Yeah, I was the widow, so I had the grim, and Vez claimed to me to be an empath with a two, and I was like, okay, like this is possibly a game where we could actually give Vez the baby. <laughs> Dang. All right. You're still so. sleeping in the guest room. 